Tonight at Coleman, we have a lot of different events. Um, we have our garden that uh, we put a lot of work and time into on display so parents and students can go out and see the different outdoor STEM labs. We also have a chance to take part in our fall dance. And on the other side of the gyms, we're having our annual Pride Night, which is just kind of to promote open house and get our parents and families involved and welcomed here in the building. So we have different carnivals for younger siblings and uh, different events for our middle school kids. And then our AVID team has put together their on annual Haunted Dome, which is uh, our third floor classroom that we never use anymore. But uh, once a year we open it up and they decorate it with the Haunted House theme and everyone goes through it and it's usually a, a lot of fun and we have a, a great evening. Our building has changed at the first open its doors in 1966, thanks to the investment by our district and our community supporters. Tonight we want to celebrate the improvements that resulted from the 2008 bond issue and to thank all those who played a part in the project. We kick tonight's festivities off here at Coleman with um, our bond celebrations. So we open up the new wing tonight. Uh, we have three new classrooms and a, a tech lab and it's uh, a lot of new space for our students and, and we're excited and we also know that we're going to be safe now that we have a dedicated safe shelter um, and FEMA shelter over here. Um, it's been an interesting process with the construction with our different traffic and the buses and the parent drop-offs, but uh, it's gone really well. Our students have handled the um, disorganization that can come from construction really well, and, and when we opened it up, they were excited, and our, our kids are really proud of their new space. So really the, the inconvenience was short-lived compared to the, the bang that we're getting with the space and, and the opportunities our kids are having. Tonight's the first night that uh, we've combined everything at once. We usually have a fall dance and then a separate night um, for families to come in. But tonight we decided to do it all. So the kids have been talking about it all week. And our sixth graders are very excited because they haven't ever experienced either one yet. So it's their first dance and their first um, pride night. So we should, should see a lot of energy. Um, and then the haunted house is always everyone's favorite. So the kids will go through there three or four times. A part of the things that we do here at Coleman is we just believe in, in reaching out to our community and reaching out to our families and our parents and making them feel welcome because we know it's all a, a partnership and we can't do what we do here every day without the help of our families and, and the parents and we know that we play a large part in helping them do what they do. So inviting them in to let them feel like this is their home away from home and so they can feel safe and secure and, and get to know our staff which only ends up helping the kids um, each and every day that we have them.